caricature cartoons only work if you recognize the caricatures. And with the Cuckoo Nut Grove, I recognized maybe half, maybe just under half. And I had a look online once I'd finished watching it. And there were a couple that I should have recognized, but didn't. But there were also a couple of names that I just hadn't heard of before. So I think I recognized, personally recognized, a decent amount to be able to enjoy what was going on. The bits that I didn't recognize, some of them were actually still okay. There were some fabulous vocal performances that actually made it quite enjoyable. Um, this is a Warner Brothers Merry Melodies cartoon from 1936. It's directed by Fritz Freelang with a story by Robert Clampett. And it's based on the Coconut Grove um, at the Ambassador Hotel in LA. And we have various caricatures of mostly actors and actresses coming together in this one location. Um, some of them are patrons, they are enjoying themselves, enjoy having a meal, having a drink, and some of them are actually giving performances. And I won't, I might, I might name one or two of the caricatures, but I won't name any of them at the moment without a spoiler warning, because at least personally, one of my favourite things about caricature cartoons, and I do love them, is trying to work out if I can identify who the caricatures are. So I don't want to spoil it, but I will say there's a really good mix of names. Um, Warner Brothers have done quite a few caricature cartoons, Disney did some as well, and I'd say a lot of the names here have been caricatured by Warner Brothers in other cartoons. There are obviously certain people who are easier to caricature, they have more prominent features or a more prominent voice, but there are also a couple ones that I don't believe I'd seen elsewhere, including a particular dancer um, whose work I'm quite a fan of. I don't think I'd seen them being caricatured, so it was quite fresh in that regard. I liked the fact that we had a mix of performances being caricatured and also the audience members, but the vocal performances are what really blew me away here. We have fabulous, um, a fabulous cast here with Ted Pierce, Danny Webb, um, Bernice Hansen, who does some fantastic work, um, several others as well, providing these really brilliant vocal caricatures. Visually as well, a lot of the characters are pretty fantastic. Some of the caricatures that I recognise I feel like Warner Brothers have done better versions of before, whereas at least one of them I thought was actually superior to a previous or maybe post version they've done after this. My timeline's a little bit off, but the point is, generally speaking, the caricatures that I recognised are very well done. The one or two that I felt I should have recognised and didn't, when I know who it is, I can see it. But Fair enough, I didn't recognise them. And then there are a couple that I obviously can't comment on, but I'd love to know if you watch this, do you have your favourite caricatures? Um, what do you think of the vocal performances for me, particularly the final song? I thought the final song was beautifully done. And this is a weird thing, but I have never seen animated tights. And I know that sounds weird, but usually when a character in cartoon wears a dress or a skirt, they'll just have bare legs because it's easier to colour the legs the same as the rest of the skin than it is to try and find the right colour to colour their legs with tights. But I think this is the first time I've actually seen somebody wearing a pair of tights in animation. I mean, I'm, I'm sure it isn't, but it stood out to me as being something I can't remember having seen. It was very well done. I really enjoyed it. Is it my favourite caricature cartoon? Mm, no, I don't think so. But certainly it's high up there. I might have to have a look back at all of the caricature reviews I've done and see see which ones stand out. But certainly the Cuckoo Nut Grove I really enjoyed. And if you like this kind of animation, I'd say it's one that's definitely worth watching.